I was lure fishing yesterday on the way back from work. I decided to keep the gear in the back of the car and go this morning as well. Different location, but hopefully not the same result as yesterday when I didn't catch. I'm on the canal now, it's an early start. Just the odd car on the road, that's all. I'll still be having an hour though. Then I'll be back home, working from home today and not too much to do. So just stuff this morning. Then I'll have the afternoon free. And my plan is to go fishing again. And the first catch of the day is a, a branch. <laughs> it doesn't count, does it, as far as fish are concerned. <laughs> but I've had a bend in my rod, albeit <laughs> from, a, from a branch that's at the bottom of the canal. It's a beautiful morning and a fish or two on the bank would most certainly be the icing on the cake. It's very tough this morning. I haven't had even a pluck or a lunge at the bait. These things happen though and especially when you are mini jigging or lure fishing in general, then by its nature, you are, you are eliminating many of the species in the venue. And even then, if I was perhaps fishing with a, a maggot, I might have a lot more perch as opposed to none so far. But it's a great way of fishing as we know, but it's not guaranteed. Nothing is, is it, is it in fishing? In fact, I was talking to an angler the other day and he was referring to the Staffordshire Worcestershire Canal, where I am now, and he mentioned a particular stretch and he said, it's very hard at the moment, very tough indeed. Even so and so, he mentioned another fisherman. Even he's not catching and he does very well on there. And you get this with venues or stretches from time to time. It's the nature of the beast. And the nature of the beast also is that as long as your bait's in the water, you've got a chance. It's a fine line sometimes, isn't it? as far as fishing's concerned. However, this morning, I'm happy to say that I'm just on the right side of that line. <laughs>